I have a confession to make. I have an addiction. Not alcohol or drugs, fortunately. Nothing as bad as that. However, it is an addiction that many speakers have contracted in their lives. In my case, the addiction is to a word. The word is so. Now, I wasn't aware of this until about a week ago when I gave a presentation. I've been doing so much coaching lately, I haven't done much speaking. So I thought I need to flex my speaking muscles and get out there and talk to a group. And I did. After the 10 minute presentation, I was informed by an evaluator that I had used the word so 11 times in 10 minutes. What's worse, I had no idea. That's when I realized I, like many other speakers, have a problem with filler words. I was horrified. I'm a coach. I teach all of this. And yet I still have the problem. I knew right then, I need help. Fortunately, there is help. It's called a video or audio recorder. I had audio recorded this particular speech I'm talking about. And when I, when I went back and listened to the recording, I realized the evaluator had actually made a mistake. I'd said it 13 times. Here's why I'm sharing this with you. We all have crutch words that we lean on when we're working with new material or we're nervous about a talk that we haven't prepared. I'm in the preparation stages of this speech and, and story that I'm working on. I was leaning on my crutch word. It just happens to be so. Occasionally, I slip a now in there. Awareness is the biggest step to remedying this problem. Watch your videos, listen to your audios, and catch yourself using words over and over again those words will be a distraction to your audience if you say them enough. I'll leave you with this. My name is Mike. I'm a soaholic, and I'm working on it. See you in our next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom.